Hey guys, what's up? Path TCGs here, and today we are going to be going over Commander Anthologies. It is a new anthology set that is going to be coming out on June 9th of 2017. That's a little bit more than a month from right now. So, some information about this set is they're going to have the three letter code CMA and the Twitter hashtag, hashtag MTGCMA. So, for those of you guys who want to follow up on the news or see what's new on the CMA set, uh, please remember that you can go on Twitter and do the hashtag MTGCMA. There's only going to be one language available and it's going to be in English, probably because it's a limited set. And the MSRP is looking to be at $164.99. Now please do remember, this applies only to the US and in your own country it could be a different price. And even for the US, they might not even sell for the $164.99. If you guys remember from Plane Chase Anthologies, it was supposed to be around this price, but now it's only selling for around $90 because the demand wasn't as high. So it's going to contain four different decks, Heavenly Inferno, Evasive Maneuvers, Guided by Nature, and Plunder the Graves. So they're going to have this all in that one box and it includes four specialized life counters, which might probably just be D20s, but I'm not sure yet. They're going to have tokens and all the cards included in the original decks. We're going to go over these decks and we're starting with Heavenly Inferno. So Heavenly Inferno is a Kalia of the Vast deck that came out in Commander 2012. It is a Mardu deck, which means white, black, and red for those who don't know the shards and it's going to be focused on putting beaters into the field. So when Kali attacks, every time she attacks she can put an angel, dragon, or demon onto the battlefield attacking. So that's why this deck is solely focused on these angels, dragons, and demons. Currently is at $250 price point, so it'll make this Commander Anthology set more than worth it to buy. Next we have Evasive Maneuvers, which came out in Commander 2013. The commander of this deck is Derevi, Imperial Tactician, and it is a Bant deck, white, green, blue for those who don't know, and it's focused on untapping creatures and putting Derevi into the battlefield. Derevi has an effect where every time um, he or she enters a battlefield, or when a creature you attack with deals damage to an opponent, you get to untap a creature and you can put Derevi from the command zone onto the battlefield for only one colorless, one white, one green, and one blue, which saves you on the commander tax. Currently it is a $40 deck, but like some of the decks I'm gonna be talking about, they are dropping in price because of the Walmart cubes. And for those who don't know, you can go to Walmart buy a cube that might have a potential commander deck that they couldn't sell before and then it'll be $20 for a $40 MSRP deck. Alright we have Guided by Nature as our fourth deck which is a Freyleaf Land Wars Fury Commander 2014 deck. It is a mono green deck that focuses on populating the field and putting a bunch of creatures on there and beating your opponent down. This deck is basically an elf tribal deck and is currently a $60 deck. Our last deck is Plunder the Graves, which is a Commander 2015 deck. This is a Golgari deck with Marin of Clan Neltoth and is focused on reanimating creatures from your graveyard. Um, for Marin, every time that you put a creature on, onto the battlefield, if the CMC is higher than the experience counters, then you get to uh, one up your experience counters and you, at the end of your turn you get to Reanimate one creature from your graveyard and put it onto the battlefield. Currently is a $49 deck, so adding that all up, it is easily well worth the price of buying this Commander Anthologies. For those of you guys who love Commander like I do, I suggest getting it. If you guys don't have these decks already, Kalia of the Vest herself is already a $40 Commander. And hopefully the price will drop soon, but because of that, I'm going to be picking one of these up just so I don't have to pick up Kalia herself and I get all these other great decks. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this review and if you guys are planning on buying it, let me know. And also please remember to like and subscribe and comment and I'll see you guys next time.